Hi, everybody. This video, I will show you how to correct the tool in the Huiman uh, multi axis simulation software. If you want to correct a new tool, we can use this button to set it. Click here. Now we can see in the tool library, we have many tools. If you want to modify a current tool, we can right click and cancel define. You see, now this tool removed from the tool list. If you want to add this, we can right, right click here and select settings. Open a uh, dialog. Click uh, click face mill. Now we have uh, two face mill. One is uh, fifty and another one is sixty three millimeters. We can click uh, the first one. Okay. This is uh, show you how to modify a uh, current tool. If we want to adding another new tools right right click this field and uh, select the settings and uh, we now we can correct a uh, drilling uh, I want to uh, add in uh, four millimeters of uh, drillings but uh, as you see we cannot uh, select uh, the uh, this uh, unit uh, stream. How to add a new tool? We can close it uh, firstly and from the tool system tools. In the system tools, we can um, select the drill and uh, in this field, right click and uh, new. You see? Now we have a drill with the name 13691. Firstly, we can rename it. For example, we can rename it 4.0. And in the two data list, we can define the machine parameter when you use these two machine. Okay, now there's two parameters is very important in this case. The first is the tool's diameter. Now we need to uh, change it to 4. And the shoulder's diameter is still 4 mm. Okay. Uh, the unit, we should be uh, select it before we define the parameter. The millimeter or inch. Also, so we can uh, define the shaft. We can use the ER or GSK. This field we can define the tool's color. Okay, when we finish it, we can just uh, exit it and uh, back to the tool's settings button. Okay, in the tool list, we can uh, add the 16 position, right, right click, and select settings and select a uh, drill from the list. You see, now we have a uh, drills with a 4.1 millimeters diameter. Okay. This video show you how to modify a current tools or how to add a new tools. Thanks for your watching.